kid. It's the kid. It's the damn kid, guys. This is it. This is one of the biggest games of the season. As you can see, I'm standing up because we have to advance. We've got to appreciate just how huge this game is because this is not a game that you sit down in. This, is, this game is big. This is huge. This could potentially be the game of the season. I'm talking across Europe because El Clasico was El Crapico. Okay. Um, Chelsea and City was popping, but we're seeing two attacking teams who say piss off to defense. Okay. Liverpool, best offensive team in, in the league. City, very smart offensive team, very good on the counter-attack, have probably the best performing player in the league in Kevin Brin. Um, this comes at a critical stage of the league. Liverpool, six points behind Chelsea. City, seven points behind Chelsea. Chelsea, of course, they'll be hoping that they, they draw and cancel each other out and Chelsea win their game and expand it even more. Liverpool and City, they don't want to draw. Favourites in this are Liverpool. Liverpool are playing at home. They've got a good record at home. Um, Liverpool are an attacking team. They, As I said, they have, they're the best offensive team in the league. And they have the best off-the-ball movement in the league without any question. Jurgen Klopp, what's up? They're going up against a team who defensively don't really listen much to, to defence. Which means that Liverpool, they will get a chance and they'll be allowed to play. So this is the game in which Pep Guardiola, you've got to do some readjusting. You've got to do some thinking. You've got to come up with something, a certain kind of ploy to try and bring down the crack. Guys, we wouldn't be seeing a lubrication. Because I love my lubrications. I love my circumcisions. I even love my menstruations. Okay, yes, I am male, not female. Well, no, I am male, actually. No re reincarnation. This, guy, this is going to be a one or two goal swing. So in Liverpool's case, it's about playing their, their game and playing their game well. If Liverpool play their game and City allow Liverpool to play their game, Liverpool will beat them because Liverpool's attack is too good and City's defence are not that resolute and they're not that hardcore to stop the kind of movement from Mane, the rage, your boy Lana, the, 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 the kid Riggy, your boy Lana, the, 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 the kid Riggy, your boy Lana, the, 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 the kid Riggy, Destry. Okay, so what's going to talk about? At the same time, let's flip it over to Man City. City can say, let's press this boy, but not press these boys too much. Defensive, keep it zonal, keep it structured, keep your shape. Make sure that it is hard for Liverpool to play through us. Make them play um, in front of us. Give them, make them play a possession-based game and see what happens there. But at the same time, Liverpool, you've got to be, be wary. Raheem the Dream Sterling on the wing and Kevin the freaking brain. These guys are dangerous. And did I mention your boy Kuhn? Sergio Kun Aguero, he's, he's, he's back in this. So we also, because remember, City could have beaten Chelsea. So for Liverpool, that's why this game is dicey. This game is dicey, which is what makes it so exciting because it can go either way. And I can see so many Gs. I can see Gs from Liverpool. I can see Gs from Man City. Okay? Um, so I was thinking long and hard about my prediction for this game. Long and hard. And... I think I've changed my prediction three times. I've changed it three times and I've settled upon this final scoreline. Because this is what I think it will be. And remember guys, watch my post-match analysis after the game. We're looking at 3-2 to Man City. I know it's going to anger a lot of Liverpool fans and people will be shocked, but I, I thought about this long and hard. Because Pep Guardiola was watching Liverpool when they lubricated Stoke. And in his mind, I believe that God, Guardiola has something prepared for Klopp. Because again, forget about Bayern and Dortmund. Forget that. That's, those are different teams. This is a whole ball of wax. So I, I don't even want to bring that in, in, into this game. But Pep has something. He's got something for that, for, for that ass. He's got something for that ass. A double S S S. Um, and it could be very dangerous. Which is why I'm saying right now that it's looking like City. Because this could be like a 1 0 or even a 2 1. This could be close. I think this could be. It's one of those games where we all assume it's going to be a lot of G's, but when it comes down to it, it may not be the IG. So it could be 2 1 to Man City instead. So you know what? You know what I'm gonna go for? I'm gonna go for a 2-1 to Man. I think Man City are gonna win this game 2-1. Okay. I don't think it's gonna be three times. I think I'm gonna lay back down 
and say this is going to be a tighter game, a much more closer game, not as open as people may, may, may think it will, it will be. Still excited, still end to end, but I don't think it will be that many Gs. So I'm going to say it's going to be 2-1 to Man City. I think City will win because I think City will come up with a strategy and deploy to nullify Liverpool's attack and Liverpool's defence against the De Bruyne and Sterling, who are two wingers who will stretch them and the way in which City counter and how Liverpool can be lighted about based on how offensive they are, I think that is just a recipe for disaster and it's going to be a path to which De Bruyne and Raheem the Dream and your boy Kuhn can really get that cheddar. Minule, bro, you've got to be on your game. Guys, it's just, I can't wait. This game's going to be popping off. Post-match analysis, remember to subscribe to the channel by clicking there and for more analysis on this game this is the premiership blog by clicking that button over there i cannot wait and guys please i'm begging you this is one thing stay black please stay black stay black